All right, guys, today's video is going to be real quick. It's not going to be all dramatic and everything, but uh, we're going to install the uh, gas tank skid plate from Nolo Designs that we sell on the Ridgeline store. Um, I actually got the one side of the vehicle up on ramps because uh, it's a lot easier. Even though I have a two-inch lift on the truck, it's still a little bit of a bear to get in there. This uh, skid plate was already installed uh, back in the spring when we all went to uh, uh, Windrock in Tennessee. So there's a picture I'm going to show right here of me. Uh, down in the rain and the muck, uh, putting the skid plate on uh, once we got down in this hairy section. So I haven't done a video on this yet. We're going to do it now. I'll just show you it's... Uh... All right, so this is the skid plate. That'll be your 10 millimeters. We've already installed this, but before it was a beta test. So we had to wire it up here with uh, just wire. So what we're going to do is uh, there's a bracket now that you'll see back there that we're going to install. And by the way, I did move. So now I got a, dra a gravel driveway. So this is extremely comfortable. And what you're going to do is those two bolts right there is what you're going to uh, attach the brackets to. And then it's going to come down to this arm and they give you two more bolts to put on that. And that's pretty much it. So it's uh, one, two, three, four bolts there. And then on the front, They'll give you uh, these three 10 millimeters. All right, so this one is going to be a 12 millimeter. These two bolts right here, here and here, which you're going to uh, loosen. I recommend an extension. By the way, if you do have a gravel driveway like I do, I recommend a yoga mat. So uh, just make sure it's your ladies. Uh, old yoga mat don't use the new ones because if you know about yoga mats to guys they should only cost five dollars but to women they cost probably like 80 freaking dollars for a spongy mat that you lay on so and uh also recommend a little magnet drawer when you're on a uh, or a bowl magnet bowl from harbor freight while you're on the gravel driveway because you end up losing bolts and screws so we'll loosen these and they provide you with uh this bolt here to attach the arm which is right here let me move this over just a tad And because mine is a beta, I'm gonna have to uh, use a rubber mallet or uh, pliers and bend this this back. Uh, when you order yours, this will be a 90 degrees. So uh, I'll be right back. But basically all we're gonna do is attach this bolt in here and then screw these two guys back up in there. And that's all there is to it. Uh, you don't have to disconnect the um, gas tank at all. You're just gonna take those three front 10 millimeter screws that I showed you before, which are right here. You'll take those out and then they're gonna give you 10 more and uh, not 10 more, they'll give you three more, a little bit longer and you'll just screw those in, so. All right, that's what it looks like all done. Everything's in there. These uh, top bolts here, they're gonna be a 12 millimeter right there. And this bolts here on the front, right there will be a 17 and then the back uh those will grip right up you shouldn't need anything and if you do it is going to be a 15. all right so that is it and then on the front you'll have a 10 millimeter and then on the front bolts here, you'll have a 10 millimeter. It's just that easy, guys. It takes like five minutes. Like and subscribe. All right, I hope that helps everybody install the NOLO Designs gas tank skid plate, and you can pick that up at theridgelinestore.com. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.